I'm David at Oberific Reads, and let's talk about English Run Readwire. There are myriads of resources available that will tell you to always use Readwire, to never use it, what kinds to use, when to put it on, and of course, lots of videos on YouTube that will show you how to put Readwire on. I'm going to link some of those in the description. To be honest, I don't always use English Horn Readwire. And if I do, I definitely don't put it on right after I've tied the blank. I'm more likely to put on the wire after the read's closer to being a finished read. The size of my tip openings on my reads aren't greatly influenced by putting read wire on or not. And the pitch of the overall sound isn't influenced that much either. <laughs> wire can't be used to fix huge issues in your read, like heavy sag or if the read is generally unbalanced. If I use it at all, I'm going to use it to give my sound a little bit more ring and to aid in projection.